Good morning, bird brains. Hope you guys had a happy holidays. I sure did. Just want to do a quick update and uh, show off all my new toys that I got over there. So uh, let's dive in and take a look. So first up on the list was the always gorgeous and always awesome Miss Biking Bird. She got me this Cena Bluetooth audio pack. For those of you who are not familiar with how this works, this is a uh, Bluetooth uh, device that hooks up to the back of the GoPro and will record whoever's hooked up to our Cena conference onto the actual GoPro audio. Now this is going to save me tons of time and tons of effort as far as videos go. So instead of having to uh, collect footage from everybody and getting the audio from that, I can just grab the audio straight from uh, my GoPro. Next up on the list is this fantastic bottle of scotch. Uh, I am a huge scotch whiskey fan. This particular bottle is Dewar's Blended Scotch Whiskey White Label Scratch Cask. Dewar's White Label is kind of their bottom line, run of the mill, just, uh, it's a very good blended scotch, it's very popular, uh, but this one's a little bit different. It's made in a scratch cask, uh, uses American oak, uh, so it's got a more a sweet vanilla flavor. I am a huge fan of this, and uh, as you can tell, some has already gone from it. And then last but definitely not least, she got me a four-piece Black & Decker tool set. Definitely going to come into use during the rebuild. It's got a nice LED flashlight, a drill and impact combo, a circular saw, and a reciprocating saw, both running off of a 20-volt lithium battery. And uh, I did get a chance to use these uh, while I cleaned the garage the other day, even though I knew I said I wasn't going to do that. Definitely happy with these. Already came in, in handy. All right, and from there we went over to my parents' house. Uh, they gave me this beautiful bike cover. This is going to come in great handy during the rebuild. After it's all said and done, I can cover it up and she won't get all nasty and dirty. She also got me this uh, Amazon Echo. For those of you who don't know what this is and have been living on your ride, this is basically a Bluetooth device that connects anything smart inside your home. You can connect it to uh, anything Bluetooth related, whether it be uh, light, security, system, anything like that. Uh, it also can hook up to your phone and set calendar appointments and give you directions on, uh, or not directions, but info on the weather and stuff like that. And then last but certainly not least, they got me this gorgeous hand-painted uh, or hand-drawn sketch of the Union Pacific 844 uh, steam locomotive. The Union Pacific 844 steam locomotive is very special to me. Uh, it is one of the last steam locomotives that were ever in service. Uh, I do come from a railroad family. I did work for the railroad for a uh, short period of time. This particular steam locomotive I rode um, between my hometown of Sanderson and Del Rio. Uh, and my dad also piloted it from uh, that, uh, that duration as well. Uh, it also has three commemorative pins down below, uh, which are very rare and very hard to get a hold of. Definitely going to have to find a nice place for that to hang. I told them when they gave it to me, I don't have a place nice enough to hang this, <laughs> but uh, we'll find something. Then moving on to uh, my Iowa parents. I call them my Iowa parents. Uh, it's Miss Bikenbird's parents. They still live in Iowa. Uh, my future in-laws, I guess you could call them. Uh, super nice people. Uh, they got me a couple bike parts uh, that I'll go into here later, but they also got me that big uh, canvas uh, train print back there. It's a four-piece steam locomotive uh, canvas print, which is awesome. Once again, I'm gonna have to find some place nice to hang that. They got me these gorgeous black and red highway pegs. Uh, they're not really specifically highway pegs, but that's what they're gonna go on on Mia, um, just because sometimes you can see them in the video. Um, there are always gonna be touches of red um, in the next build once she goes through her makeover and everything like that. And then definitely not least uh, was the James Scott Crystal Whiskey set. This was from Team Bradley. Uh, if you're new to the channel, Team Bradley is my best friend. He pops up probably most frequently in the videos. Uh, and I don't know if this will be coming out after or before. He was the one that I pranked during the uh, last episode, but uh, definitely a nice gift. It's four crystal glasses, once again, related to alcohol and scotch and whiskey. I'm such a mess. But yeah, I like to drink scotch whiskey and nice glasses are a plus. It also has a crystal decanter in there, which I did not have and wanted. So good job on that one, Brad. Oh, I almost forgot. My parents got me this t-shirt. It says a life behind bars and then it has a bike right there with the handles. So guys, tell me down in the comments, what did you get for Christmas? Did you get everything on your list? Did you get motorcycle parts? Or did you get a big old fat sack of coal because you've been an asshole all year? 
Either way, let me know down in the comments below. You know I love hearing from you guys. I respond to literally 99% of the comments, and I usually do it when I'm pooping. So if you've ever gotten a response, think of that next time. Well, guys, once again, I hope you had a happy holidays. Uh, let's look forward to an awesome 2017. 2016 was awesome to both me and the channel, and I don't expect 2017 to be any less. Go ahead and hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. And as always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh!